Gaga's giving it a shot at playing me. She seems nice. Oh, I waited for this trailer uh, the entire day yesterday, but it didn't, uh, Warner Brothers didn't upload it uh, until uh, like uh, 2 a.m. Uh, in my country. So that uh, will be why my trailer review is later to the party than, than others. Uh, but so, uh, hey guys, Harry Thomas here, and welcome. Uh, DC fans are to uh, my uh, trailer thoughts on the first teaser trailer for my uh, number one most anticipated comic book movie of 2024. Uh, yes, even over Deadpool and Wolverine Joker Folia Duax, which uh, releases uh, the month of my 29th birthday. Perfect movie to see for my birthday. This is the only DC movie we are guessing in 2024. Now that the DCU is uh, dead and buried, and uh, this year is dominated by uh, the Sony uh, Spider Man villain verse. And we've waited uh, five years for this movie since Joker 2019, one of the most uh, masterfully crafted uh, comic book movies, uh, period. So, Todd Phillips, uh, show us what you got. The dude that directed uh, the Hangover trilogy is has uh, uh, upped uh, his uh, game as a filmmaker uh, to uh, an, an 11 with, with these Joker movies. So let's see if he can justify this sequel's existence. And even though Joker 2019 could have worked uh, fine as a standalone movie, uh, uh, a, a sequel can uh, be uh, just as worthy, even though I doubt this will top Joker 2019, but it could be uh, close. And uh, uh, this uh, trailer, I have to say, uh, was uh, fabulous. And uh, uh, it uh, looks as artistically shot as uh, its predecessor. So a uh, cinematography uh, still... Uh, uh, me mesmerizes me. Uh, it looks like they're changing the origin story of uh, Harley, just like they changed the origin for uh, Joker in the last movie, as uh, I do it doesn't look like she's going to be a psychiatrist working at Arkham Asylum who gets corrupted by Joker. It looks more like uh, she's uh, going to be a patient to act in Arkham, uh, just uh, like uh, him. And but in all honesty, just from trailer impressions alone, uh, I uh, uh, doubt Lady Gaga is going to be a patch on Margot Robbie's Harley Quinn, and uh, my suspicions uh, were confirmed with this trailer footage. Not just because Margot Robbie is the goat of uh, all movie stars and uh, the uh, unbeatable uh, Harley Quinn, Mwah. But, uh, but Gaga's Harley Quinn in comparison, she doesn't look like she's going to go all out like Margot. She just looks like she's uh, kind of sugarcoating the role more and watering it down. But nonetheless, I'm sure she will still dazzle us as Harley, as Margot said she was perfectly happy for some uh, for a different actress to take on the role. And I'm sure when Gaga... And I'm sure when Margot uh, watches the movie, she will uh, approve of uh, uh, Gaga's uh, portrayal, as Gaga has proven to uh, be an electrifying actress in her own right. It's just watch her in A Star Is Born, 2018. Her chemistry uh, with a uh, Walking Phoenix as Joker does look strong, and Walking Phoenix looks like he is still a uh, lost none of his mojo as Arthur Fleck, and this was the role that deservedly won him in a Casimir Awards. So if both him and Gaga can be a Casimir Award nominated for Joker and Harley, well, that would be uh, utterly re remarkable. And uh, it looks like a Joker and Harley will have uh, uh, shows on stage together. As uh, one thing that differentiates this one from the first movie is that this is a musical. And if this movie is keeping the mature tone of the first movie and is rated R uh, for uh, drug use and, and strong violence, blood and even brief uh, nudity, then I'm sure the songs uh, will be more sombre and atmospheric uh, rather than uh, happy-go-lucky. Like, think of this as a darker, more psychologically uh, testing version of singing in the rain or, or La La Land. 
And there is one shot in this trailer that uh, looked uh, particularly brutal with a Joker slamming a chair on, on, a, on a dude in a bar. <laughs> oh my god, that is gonna be the uh, moment like in the first movie when Joker brutally murders a Randall with the scissors and uh, and shoots Murray on, on live TV and uh, uh, and we even get shots of an explosions and Joker and Harley running from uh, a burning building and uh, even s some uh, vandalism of shot windows kind of like uh, the moment in Suicide Squad when Harley breaks a shot window and says we're bad guys it's what we do uh, and uh, but of course the most iconic shot in this trailer which everybody's talking about is a uh, Harley's lipstick on Joker's smile I instantly iconic and uh, the 2019 Joker well uh, made uh, Warner Brothers what one billion dollars uh, so if uh, uh, Folia Duox uh, can uh, also br uh, deliver the goods and bring in uh, the, the numbers uh, then uh, uh, th then uh, they they may be convinced to green light J Joker 3 and make this a trilogy but uh, uh, yeah, and also I am overjoyed uh, that uh, Hildor uh, Goffindor, the uh, composer of the uh, 2019 Joker, is returning to compose the score here because her score for the original Joker was uh, uh, astonishing. So I'm sure uh, she'll give us one of the finest scores of this entire year with a folly a duox uh, and. Uh, even when there's not uh, songs, uh, her uh, score will uh, be uh, captivating. So yeah, uh, this uh, and Wild Robots uh, will be uh, two terrific uh, movies to check out uh, in, in in October. And uh, you know, if this doesn't turn out to be my favourite superhero movie of the year, then I will be uh, gobsmacked. So, well, I love you guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this trailer review. And uh, what's the your uh, thoughts on uh, the uh, teaser for Joker Folly or Duox? Are you impressed or, or not impressed? Uh, please comment and let me know. Please like this video and subscribe. Please follow on Twitter and Instagram. And I'll see you all next time. And remember, movies are us. Bye, guys. <laughs>